Hey guys, my name is Halex and welcome to my channel. Now before I actually start this off, I'm just going to go ahead and say that if you want to download One Piece Treasure Cruise, you can go ahead and click the link in the description down below and uh, do so. But yeah, so pretty much this is going to be a beginner's guide or at least a beginner's guide of what I think is most important at the start of the game for new players that might be struggling um, just like I did. So first thing I want to talk about is transponder snails. You can get 5 each day and they reset every day at 4am. Now the reason why you're gonna want transponder snails is because they pretty much give you free gifts, 5 free gifts every day. Um, you can get turtles, belly which is the currency of the game, cola, etc etc which in my opinion are really worth it. Now if you happen to search around your map and you can't seem to find a turtle that's completely fine. All you need to do is just go to a quest and then come back later and you will most likely find a turtle. I'm not guaranteeing it, you might have to do another one, but eventually you'll get a total of five turtles per day, not turtles, I mean transponder snails per day. And uh, yeah, so, now that we have talked about the transponder snails, which is the most basic thing in my opinion, I'm gonna move on to turtles. Now, turtles have a certain type, a certain type, each turtle has a certain type. There are blue turtles, which are QCK, green turtles that are DEX, red turtles that are STR, and you already know the rest. So pretty much, why does it matter that they have types? Turtles are pretty much, well, let's, for, let's say for example that you give a red Dymo turtle to a Horn Point Tony Tony Chopper, which is a QCK type. Instead of giving the Chopper 22.5K, XP it will give him 15k because it's unmatched when it comes to type now That's something that you really do want to make sure um, You do correctly because you could end up losing a lot of XP Which is really pointless considering it's hard to get that much XP back normally now I gave the example of a Dymo turtle, but if that thing were to happen with an elder turtle I'm pretty sure that um Instead of getting 82.5k, you would be getting 50k or something like that, which is pretty insane. Which is why I recommend that you make sure that you match the right types of turtles with the characters that you want to level up. Now, you heard me talk about Elder Turtles and you might not be sure what I meant by that. But there are three types of turtles. There are Treasure Turtles, Dymo Turtles, and Elder Turtles. The Elder Turtles are the ones that you want the most because they give the most XP, obviously. The Elder Turtles, if you give them to the right, well, matched character, are supposed to give you 82.5k XP each. The Dymo Turtles are supposed to give you 22.5k each, and the Treasure Turtles are supposed to give you 3k XP each. Now, if you happen to cross uh, or stumble into a pork, now, considering they don't have a difference between the two the two evolutions, I'm just going to go ahead and say four legs and uh, two legs. So, if you happen to stumble into a, a four legs standing pork, you're going to want to keep on to that. Do not sell it or try to do anything with it except for evolving. Because once you evolve it using a treasure turtle, you will actually get a two standing pork. Now, what does that mean? A two standing pork will actually give you more XP than a treasure turtle, which is why you're better off just evolving a uh, four leg pork into a two leg pork because eventually you'll be profiting off of the treasure turtle instead of just settling for 3k XP. And that is the end of the first section of my uh, three part guide. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like as uh, subscribe for the next content or whatever is gonna pop up I'm not quite sure myself but uh, yeah if you want to stick around for more you can go ahead and click that subscribe button as I've just said you can go ahead and uh, like this video comment down below um, if you have any suggestions although I highly recommend that you keep your suggestions for the last episode considering you're not too sure what could go up at least I don't think you are um, but yeah Later.